Good morning. What Canada brings to this summit is the understanding that government exists to improve the lives of citizens. Digital is opening up previously unimaginable possibilities for how government can fulfill this fundamental role. Digital has everything to do with enabling, empowering, and serving people better. And at a time when democratic governments around the world are facing challenges of legitimacy, digital provides new opportunities to make government relevant to the lives of citizens. In Canada, we're committed to providing our citizens with the reliable, accessible, and secure digital services that they deserve in the 21st century, on their smartphones and tablets, at a time and place that's convenient to them. Today, as an organization, you're either digital or you're dead. If a company doesn't get digital right, it's out of business. If a government doesn't get digital right, it's out of touch. Our relevance to citizens is in jeopardy if we can't deliver world-class government digital services. To do that means we have to do things differently and we have to adopt a modern digital mindset. We have to put users' real needs at the center of service delivery. We have to embrace innovation and experimentation in designing and even reinventing our services to find the best ways to meet those needs. That's why I'm so excited that the D5 has invited Canada's participation. Joining the D5 gives Canada fresh opportunities to learn from the world leaders in digital government. And at the same time, New Zealand's invitation to join the D5 is recognition of our own efforts in advancing digital government in Canada. Being able to access expertise in other digital nations can only support all of our progress. It's also a testament not only to the work that has been going on for many years across Canada, but also to our ambition and commitment to go even further with great digital government services. I can tell you that I am personally invested and extremely excited about digital government and the potential for the future. We're simply thrilled that this commitment has earned us a place at the table with the leading countries in the world. We look forward to learning from you and working with you to continue advancing digital principles and practices and, and get better at serving our citizens.